right, now we're moving on to Sag. So if somebody could type in Sagittarius Sun, Sagittarius Moon, Sagittarius Rising. And that's it, they just said. Sagittarius Sun, Moon, and Rising. And I will pin that up into the chat. Watching over Sagittarius over this Mercury season. We have Nana Baluku. Y'all want to know something? I get kind of jealous that I can't sit there and chat with y'all in the chat. Because <laughs> y'all be having fun and I can't. I see all these smiley um, emojis and stuff. I'm like, what did I miss? <laughs> Archangel Christelle showing up again. Thank you, Fate. Go ahead and pin that. There we go. Oh, and that's it, Lisa. Modern deck, we have pleasure. Mm. Sag. What y'all up to? Naughty bits. Your naughty bits are out there. Your naughty bits have been out there, Sagittarius. Oh my god, I'm blushing. Y'all been naughty in the bedroom. Hmm. All right, so I have clear endeavor. This is your love relationship portion of the reading, Sagittarius. X-ray. Ooh, your nutty books have been out there. So, um, somebody's going to get caught. Uh, you might want to prepare yourself. If you've been doing things with somebody you should not be doing, this Mercury retrograde is going to bring that out. For the world to hear um yeah it's gonna be like tabloid news it's gonna be some juicy gossip Ooh. yeah I'll, i was checking to see if it was like money related or anything else it's like no it's just in your love life so if you, for anybody <laughs> Of course, it's not going to be for everybody. But if you are in a situationship that you should not be in, meaning that not all parties know they're in a situationship, uh, keep your head low and pray for the best. Because I think that's going to come out. Oh, sorry. That was loud. I have them. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's coming out. I have the moon. Ooh, Mercury retrograde. I'm seeing like a text group blow up. It's going to be a lot of gossip. And you know what? It might not be you. So if you're sitting there going, I'm not doing anything. You're right. This is just in general, something, um, a relationship is going to be exposed I'm hearing the news and I'm hearing like law and order. So it might be, um, oh God, I just heard essential and, um, minor, a minor age situation might come out. Damn it. Told y'all Christmas is gonna be some shit. Um, the what is this? Five, six, seven, eight of cups. Oh, yeah, it's family dynamics for sure. Queen of Wands information. Oh, thank you, Fate. You like it? A um, a subscriber gifted it to me. I was I unboxed it earlier, so if you want to rewind it back, I was I was very happy to receive it. Very nice. Very nice. Um, I'm very appreciative. So I, um, the queen, I just felt like I was on QVC. <laughs> it holds three large oracle cards and you have spots where you could put gems and oracles. Let me demonstrate. Here. Look at that. Look how beautiful this card holder is. 
And for only $9.99, you too can hold, can can own this beautiful tarot deck card holder. I have no idea how much it costs. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> I'm just going with it. Um, all right. I'm sorry. Back to the reading. I get distracted. Like, I have these serious squirrel moments. Like, squirrel. All right. So, the Queen of Wands. Yeah. Information is coming your way. It's either you that's going to get exposed or someone you know is going to get exposed. It's going to be major tabloid news that's going to rock a lot of people's lives. Things are not going to be the same. It's really not going to be the same. I have the sun in the reverse. <sighs> this reminds me I need to do a DC tarot rating because of all the stuff going on with the DC movies. Again, I told you, it's like a squirrel. But um, the reason why I brought it up, because I saw, um, Hen in my head, I saw Hen Henry Cavell post that he wrote where he said that, that he no longer will be Superman. And it it was after he was contracted to be Superman and they decided to go a different route. And it was big news because of that. You know, I'm telling you, big news coming your way and it's not going to be pretty it's family situation the fool it's family situation it might have to do with a child which is grossing me out like i feel like throwing up it might have to do with a child i'm praying it's, it's not i'm praying it's not and i have um the three of cups but as creepy as I feel right now, like, like, like spiders all over me, I have a feeling it has to do with a child. And it's going to definitely come through from now through February. All this is going to be in play. There, I just heard, you'll know when things start to get quiet. So if, um, let's say you're in a group chat. And all of a sudden, people aren't chatting anymore. Or, um, you, on online, like on Facebook, and normally, your family or friends are posting five or six times a day, and suddenly, you don't see that person posting anymore. You're going to know it's happening, or it's about to happen, when things get shut down online so online or text when people start to draw their energy back it's because they're hiding because they're trying to hide from being exposed but it's going to come out and if this is your you if you're in the person in a situation ship and not everybody knows of the entanglement uh, good luck that's all i'm not judging i'm just saying good luck because it's just about to hit the flame. It truly is. All right, moving on to your money, Sagittarius. I want me to leave that. I want me to leave that. And I'm going to do like my incense because I didn't like what I heard about the child. <sighs> There's times when you hope um, as a reader that you're wrong and I'm really, really hoping you're wrong about that. Okay, moving on to... Hmm. I shall do that. Moving on to um, your money, Sagittarius. I'm sorry. I just had to reset. All right. Yeah, no fate. Like, sometimes being the messenger is a good thing. Sometimes I'd rather not <laughs> be the messenger. And, yeah. So, but at the same time, you're right. Like, this, the message needs to come out for whatever reason. So maybe the person in a family situation like that needed a heads up to prepare to what's going to happen because i feel th there's a lot of uh, generational curse breaker energy 
I'm feeling right now, so it might be the reason why the heads up was giving because they need to be the strong person in the family. Uh, fall season, ask them out. This is money. This is money. Money, finances, careers, divine one. There's going to be an opportunity coming your way. Double trouble. It's going to be fun. Your work life is going to be fun. You're going to have fun. You're going to... It's going to... If you've been feeling like you're not adequate or good enough for your job, that is not the case. You're better than you think you are. Um, especially if this is like a new job energy or you're about to start a new job. Yeah, about to start a new job because we have asked them out. So this might be a like a job offer coming your way that you might not think you were going to get because your resume is not as plush as you thought it needed to be. But this is very... Very good energy, I have to say. This is like um, unexpected surprise, unexpected rewards coming your way in um, in work and money. In particular, work. This is strong work energy right now. You're gonna like your supervisors love you. They think you're great. They really do. Um, I was saying in Pisces, you had a feminine energy that it wasn't that she didn't want to support you she just had to do her job so funny this came out as i was talking about that person but in this case there's a supervisor your supervisor got your back surprisingly but there is because i i say that because we all know at the end of the day supervisors got to do their jobs as well versus favoritism right but there's definitely favoritism here in your favor there's a buddy buddy situation so in pisces i would say beyond your p's and q's um, I don't want to say Sagittarius to relax, but at the same time, you can relax. Like, um, missing, going to work a few minutes late because you want to go to Starbucks is not going to hurt you. Versus with Pisces, it would. So you could just turn it back a little bit. You might have been stressed. And so, um, are you your own toxic? Yeah, you are. You your own toxic person at work because you're worried about work. You're worried about getting fired. Maybe there's um, watching too much news because a lot of people are getting fired. If you're in the, uh, yeah, they said that if you're worried about getting fired and your finances, be proactive and start shopping your resume. Or you might want to get a part-time job or become an independent contractor. Where you have your own schedule, or start an online business, or something, or just for YouTube, <laughs> or become a YouTuber, <laughs> which I am. I'm still waiting for the 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 pot of gold <laughs> for that. But basically, is um, I just heard I'm gonna get it. Thank you. Um, but basically, it's um, you are your own worst enemy, right? So if that's the case, let's say. How will you defeat your enemy? You would find their weakness and fight them to the death. Your weakness, your weakness is you feel like you don't have options. So give yourself options. Just knowing that you have options is going to make you relax and enjoy the next few weeks. Because overall, Sag, you have a great... Um, Mercury retrograde going for you. I don't understand this. I came on here for the most part thinking everything is going to be doom and gloom. Your love, the family whole situation withstanding. I have to say this, this energy so far has been really great. <laughs>